Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I decided to show you guys how I created this, um, I guess, half cut crease if you wanted to say. Um, so if you want to see how I created it, then just keep watching. Okay, so for the most part of this video, I am going to be using Star Crush Mineral products. I do have a 50% off code with them. Um, their products, honestly, their original prices are up to like $8, but when you use my 50% off code, it brings it down from like $150 to like $4, and their products are absolutely amazing, so I do recommend them. Um, but yeah, you can just see that I'm placing Juicy all in my crease, and I'm kind of bringing it up to the front part of my eyebrow. And I'm just going to keep blending that back and forth until I get that the way I like. And then I'm going to go in with Havoc from Star Crush Minerals as well. But I'm placing that just on the inner corner of my eye just to deepen that up some more. And then I'm going to go back in with a darker black and a smaller Sigma brush. And I'm just going to deepen that up even more. Okay, so I'm just going to keep blending out that color until I get it blended out the way I want it to. And then I'm going to go back in my outer corner and intensify that orangey yellowish color whatever you want to call it until I get that the way I want it to as well and y'all know I'm extremely tedious when it comes to my blending so I'm just going to keep going back in and adding more color and intensifying and blending and buffing everything out until I see absolutely no harsh lines ridges or anything like I want everything to be nice and blown out and then once I do that I'm going to go back in with cinnamon which is more of like a dark brown and I'm going to start to deepen out my outer corner um, and I'm kind of doing the same thing that I did on my inner corner, which is darkening it, but I'm not going to bring it up into my crease. So it's going to be dark on the outside, dark on the inside, but light on the center of my lid. And then I'm going to cut my crease, and then I'm going to start adding the glitter. You guys are always asking me what my fave glitter is, and at the moment, it's definitely Star Crush. Their glitters are so reflective, like they are absolutely gorgeous, and they're super, super inexpensive. With my code, they're only like four bucks. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go in with this NYX yellow liner and I'm just going to start to cut my crease. I don't know what made me do this, but I thought it looked cute. <laughs> so yeah, um, that's that. Okay, so now I'm just going to take Havoc and Berry Tail from Star Crush Minerals and I'm going to add that in my inner corner just to add a pop of color and to intensify it some more. Um, but yeah, I'm going to do that on the inner and the outer corner and then I'm going to do that in the center of my crease as well. And I just want to make sure you guys know that, again, I'm extremely tedious when it comes to blending. So keep, keep, keep blending. If you feel like nothing is blending out, just keep blending until you see no more harsh lines. Right now, I'm just going to go in and add a black just to intensify everything. And I am going to go in and add a black to intensify everything, but I'm going to pack the black on first, and then I'm going to blend it out instead of just trying to go in and just blend everything out at once because I don't want the black to just go everywhere. Um, so I'm going to go in, pack it on, and then blend it out. Okay, so now I'm just adding black eyeliner to my waterline. This water... Water... <laughs> This eyeliner is probably one of the best black eyeliners I've ever used in my entire life. It is so black, y'all. Like, I don't even, you can just see how black it is. It is crazy black. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to go back in with Foxy from Star Crush Minerals just to smoke everything out and make sure everything looks nice and even and uniform. And I'm really, really, really going to smoke out my lower lash line just because that's the way I like it. If you don't want to do it like that way, you don't have to. Um, but I'm going to drag it down pretty far. Okay, so now I'm just taking a Morphe brush and this color called Lemon Drop Martini from Star Crush Minerals, and I'm adding that to my inner corner. It's just a really pretty yellow. I felt like it complemented the yellow in my crease. So I'm laying down Too Faced Glitter Glue first, and then I'm just packing a bunch of that color on top of that.
Okay, so I'm just going to go in with my favorite bronzer at the moment, which is Suntan Bronzer from Jouer Cosmetics. And then after I do that, I'm going to go back in with Stole the Show from ColourPop, which is just a cream highlighter. And a lot of you guys ask me how I like to use them, and usually it's just either a beauty blender on my finger, but at the time I was lazy and didn't feel like wetting my beauty blender. So I use my finger, um, and then after I use that, I'm going to go back in with a Star Crush Minerals highlighter, which is absolutely gorgeous, y'all. If you follow me on Twitter or Snapchat or anything, I'm sure you see me swatch them. But Stay Classy from Star Crush Minerals is absolutely everything. And then um, everybody always asks me how I apply these highlighters. And I just use my regular M501 from Morphe like I always do. Um, you just tap it in there, tap off the excess, and put it on your face. But guys, y'all, look how pretty this freaking highlighter is. Like, It gives me a glow like no other. And then the fact that it's only $4, like, just blows my mind. But anyways, uh. Okay, so now I'm just going to go ahead and pop my lashes on. I always get a ton of questions on how I put them on and, like, what lash glue I use. I use House of Lashes Dark Glue, and what helps me is when I look down into a mirror and push the lashes as close to my lash line as possible. Um, and you definitely need to wait for the lash glue to get tacky. That's definitely something that you have to have to do. And this wouldn't be a Taylor McGahee tutorial if I didn't add more eyeshadow that I didn't need. So I'm just going back in with Juicy and adding more yellow, um, making everything a little bit more intensified. I absolutely love warm eyeshadow for whatever reason. So whenever I get the chance to do this, I go in. <laughs> Like the attention, girl, I know you, know you. But you're everything I want in life yeah. We're fighting danger like Kung Fu The love I feel is deep inside The others don't matter Okay, and I felt like this eye look wasn't done, so I went back in with um, that same NYX liner, and I just added these weird, like, random lines everywhere on the outside of my eye and, like, on my inner corner. And then for my lip color, I ended up using Brick from Jouer Cosmetics and uh, Venice from Ofra Cosmetics, and that's it. I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. If you have anything you want to see next time, just let me know. I love you guys, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!